turned out to be alone again Could I take you by the hand and never go Would I tell you that Welcome again, I am Fawad and this is a course about the Python In this lecture I will tell you that how you can assign multiple values to a single variable for example, I have variable x, y, and z, and I want to assign multiple values. So I will write subscribe my when I write this like this, the subscribe will be assigned. The string subscribe will be assigned to variable x. The string, uh, the string y will be assigned to variable y, and the string channel will be assigned to variable z. If I print the values of these variables, we'll see the detail. Like within x, the subscribe was stored, so it should like that in the output window. If I print the value of y and if I print the value of z, we'll see the respective values. If I print it in another sequence, we will see subscribe channel my if I comment these two and I run it so through this method you can store the multiple values you can initialize multiple variables in a single line of code I can also assign the values to this variable in a, another way x y and z is equal to values in an array i have created an array the name of that array is values and i have stored or defined three uh, string variables three strings like subscribe comma my comma channel and when i assign this to x y and z and I run the code you will see uh, each variable has been assigned with it respective string value now how can I display the output of the variables like suppose x contains subscribe and y include my and z include channel And I print it like this. So it will give me the output in one go. If you look into this, there is no any spaces in between these variables. So I can create spaces like uh, I can add a space over here and then I can add another space over here if I run it now you can see there some oh, spaces have been created I can also include some more text the variable x contain string the variable x contain string subscribe if x contain some integer value
then there will be an error and the error is there the concatenation of string is only possible through this way so the integer cannot be combined through this way if I write it like this again the same error we can only concatenate strings through this method this variable is an integer if I convert it into string then there is no error data type of the initially the data type of this variable was integer so it gave me an error now when I change the data type of this variable into string now there is no any error we can also write it like this the value of x is equal to the value of x equal to 5 now I will declare some the some of the variable and this uh, so I have created a function I have created assigned a global variable value I created a function and if when I call that function it gave me the resultant printed command which was inside the function now let's suppose I change the value of the variable x and I assign it another value x and I run this code now you can see the uh, global variable which uh, contain the value of the variable x is equal to 5 and in inside the function definition uh, the variable value the value of the variable x has changed from 5 to 6 and when I have called this function initially the value of x was 5 but since within the function the value of y x has changed so it has shown as the value of the uh, local inside the function or uh, the value of the variable x inside the function now if i write the same line over here so the first uh, output is the uh, due to calling the function my function and the second is the print command which i have written over here the print command show the result of uh, the value of x is equal to 5 while the function show the value of x is equal to 6 so this is the global variable so it can do it can be assigned and value can be replaced inside the function but the global value of the variable x will unchange this was all about the variable uh, type casting and other methods I will tell you some more detail about the Python language in the next sort of video. Stay tuned with us. Thank you so much.